VA housekeeping aide Bill Hunter uses elbow grease to keep the halls clean. Not so long ago, this veteran felt he was out of options. I've been in the Salvation Army, staying on the street, sleeping in cars, all of that. I've been through everything, went through the whole drug scene, you know, because that's what you end up doing. You try to do anything there is as a value, donate blood just to have a little bit of money. While the number of veterans in Kansas who are homeless is up slightly from last year, since 2010 it's gone down 69.5 percent. Advocates say veterans are becoming more aware of available services. We really work with them to try to get them either emergency housing, um, you know, back rent or utilities paid, whatever we can do to either salvage their current housing or help them get stably housed someplace else. But housing is only part of it. We work with veterans to try to get them community resources. We have um, supportive services for veterans and families through the Salvation Army, which is a great resource. Bill says he's received help for PTSD and mental health concerns, and the VA connected him with a range of programs, helping him make a clean start and get back on his feet. Only thing you have to do is just come up to the VA and ask for some help, and you will get it. That's the only thing I can tell them, and I keep it 100. You have to come and get help if you want help.